Hello, this is Lisa from Happy Stamp, <clears throat> and today we're going to be making this uh, painted poppies card. <clears throat> I've kept it uh, with no sentiment so that I can just use it for anything that I need to. Um, Stampin' Up! has challenged us to sell three of these stamp sets, so um, I'm going to try and do that. Anyone that purchases the stamp set from me, you are going to get um, kits to make all three of these cards. So I'm going to give you everything in the kit. Um, I can't do any of the stamping for you. You have to do that yourself. But I will send you all of um, everything to make these three cards. <clears throat> now this stamp set does not come with sentiments. And I have used the sentiments from Peaceful Moments, if you're interested in that. Um, but you can put your own sentiment on there um, so that you can make them anything that you want. Um, if you have any questions, feel free to leave me a comment below. I will be happy to answer them. Um, one other thing that's going on right now is our um, incentive for joining Stamping Up. <clears throat> For $99, you get $125 worth of product that you pick out. Um, free shipping. You're also going to get this mini trimmer. Really cute. Um, a 6x6 six six packet of designer series paper. Now this is a little sampling of all of the papers that are in the Occasions catalog. That is current right now. And then you're also going to get a stamp set of your choice. So another stamp set that you pick out. Um, is going to be coming to you. Um, so like I said, that's $99 free shipping. If you have any questions on that, feel free to leave me a comment below regarding that. All right, so let's go ahead with this card. You're going to need a piece of Poppy Parade that is four and a quarter by 11, and I've scored that at five and a half. A piece of Poppy Parade that is four by five and a quarter. A piece of Whisper White that is four by five and a quarter. I am using the, oh, I have to leave it out. The Peaceful Poppies Designer Series Paper. Um, this is beautiful Designer Series Paper. I'm using that. And this piece is four by one and a half. And this piece is four by a half an inch. All right, then you're also going to need another scrap, excuse me, of Whisper White for the flower. <clears throat> All right, so I'm going to take this and I'm just going to fold that in half and use my bone folder to get a nice crease on that. Okay, I'm going to take my piece of Poppy Parade that is four by five and a quarter and I'm going to um, layer that with this piece of designer series paper <clears throat> and I'm going to put that about a half an inch from the edge so I'm going to use my grid paper here and I know two of the squares are half an inch so I'm going to put that right above two squares and get this, okay. There we go. Right, then I'm going to take this piece and that's just going to butt right on top of that. I'm going to set that right on top. Alright, okay. All right, now I'm going to take this and I'm going to use some of my dimensionals. <clears throat> and I'll put 
put some of those on the back. set that aside for a second. I'm going to take my scrap of Whisper White and I think I forgot to grab my stamp pad. So I have my Poppy Parade ink here <clears throat> and my Memento ink. I'm going to take the outline of the flower Ink that up. <clears throat> and I'm just going to stamp this. All right. Then I'm just going to take this swatch here with my Poppy Parade. And I'm going to ink that up real well. And I'm just going to put that right on top. No coloring involved. So that's just going to go right on top. Just like that. <clears throat> and I'm going to take my 2 inch punch. 2 inch circle punch. And I'm going to punch this out. So that can go on dimensionals right on the top of here. Get those off of here. All right, and then this can go right over here. Now if you wanted to put a sentiment on here, you could take a thin strip um, and put a sentiment on, you know, ha happy birthday, whatever you wanted to put on there, and just have that stick out there. I'm going to put mine when I need it on the inside. Dimensional backs are just giving me problems today. All right, so then that's going to go right on the front of here. Get, try and get a, there we go, even border on all of the sides there. Then you can take your piece of Whisper White for on the inside that you um, can write your sentiment on. I'm just going to put a little snail right up, up at the top. And then that can go right in here. And then the last thing that I'm going to do is I'm going to grab some of the sequins from the Noble Peacock pack. I'm going to use these um, old olive ones right here. And just put like three around. And then there you have it. That's all there is to it. So if you have any questions, please feel free to leave me a comment below. I'll be happy to answer them. All supplies can be purchased through my online store at happystamp.stampinup.net. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Bye.